All right, let me just let y'all in on a little something. There is literally nowhere to film in Nashville. Did I just pull into a random motel parking lot and I'm still super fucking anxious just to film this video? Yes, because I can't film while I'm driving. I don't have anything to keep my camera still. Look how fucking anxious I am. Oh my God, the sun is literally glistening. Glisten, baby, glisten. There's literally nowhere to go. There's people everywhere. Like you'd think you'd come to the city to take cute tripod like city girl pics. No, not by yourself. With a friend, it's fine, but I don't have those. There's literally people on every corner. I'm not kidding. I literally just that I almost got kidnapped. So I just went to go get a bunch of pants altered that I've been putting off for so long. I literally have like four pairs. Well, no, I have six, but I only brought four because I was too embarrassed and I didn't want to be like, see, like I, I, I think too much. I didn't want to be annoying and be like, have a lot to do even though that's their job. So I only brought four and I literally thought I was gonna get kidnapped. Like, do you know how many phone calls I fake when I'm like places just because I'm like, meh. I don't even know where I was. It was so far away. And then she, today's Wednesday. And she goes, um, can you come Wednesday? And I'm like, next Wednesday? like back at home like I have people that were like come back in an hour but I didn't say anything because I don't speak up because I'm too nervous so I said yeah that sounds good and then I left and then I was like <laughs> like now I'm not gonna go to whatever I planned tonight because I don't have a pair of pants to wear tonight and I don't know what I'm gonna do this weekend because I think I'm gonna call back and ask but like like, like, like we know that's not ever gonna happen I pay monthly memberships for things that I don't attend because I'm too sh too embarrassed to call and cancel I hate why am I the way I am why do I work this way okay now the sun's kind of irritating me and it's just my eyes but anyways I just wanted to do a little like car talk hello yeah anyways Nashville life do we love it do we hate it who knows yeah I gotta go pick up a shit ton of packages. Not really, it's just Amazon. Uh, follow my Amazon storefront if you guys don't already because I go live, I did my everyday makeup routine on there. That's the only reason I have like full glam on right now. But then I was like, y'all y'all crazy if you think I'm actually gonna do my hair. Nope, that's a big no. Ooh, these houses are pretty. I wanna live in a house, but then living alone, like I'd be scared in a whole house. Ugh, ow, mother frick. Look at these cute rings I got from Judith Bright. I think that's how you say it. They're located in Nashville. You probably can't see because my autofocus actually sulks. Sorry. All right, I feel so awkward sitting here, so I'm gonna go. Okay, love you. Bye. Woohoo! All my packages. Hello, everybody. I look all, I always look the fucking same. Why do I look so goddamn pale? This lighting's supposed to make me prettier, damn it. All right, so I just picked up a literal sharp ton of packages, so I'm gonna do a quick little unboxing, if you would. So if you don't know, I do these little Amazon lives. This is not even fucking exciting, bro. I just like goddamn needed some scotch tape. A whole pack because I do Poshmark. Follow my Poshmark, I sell all my clothes. This is my shipping tape. And I do a lot of returns because if you don't know, I don't like to go shopping in person. So I order a ton of stuff online. Try on, I order everything in like every size and then try it on and send it all back. Is it very inconvenient? Yes. But I'm like recycling, I'm reusing this stuff, you know? And I don't have to get out of my house. Anyways, I do Amazon Lives. See, I don't want to destroy the bags. Wait, <gasps> this is not Amazon. This is from Revolve. I am on the hunt for a good pair of jeans because I wear the same pair every day and I'm too big. I'm two sizes bigger than I was last year. So, although last year I was really going through it, but big girls gotta eat. Okay, these are just some Levi's from Revolve. Maybe I'll try them on for you. Maybe I won't, probably won't, but <laughs> who knows? So I go live on Amazon Live and I'm now upgraded to an A-lister, whatever that means. So now I have all these new, I'm sorry, I have all these new benefits. So now it's uh, really cool going live and I do like four lives a month or I'm supposed to and I share new stuff. So I'm always constantly getting new stuff from Amazon. Look at this little motherfucking bucket hat. It has a smiley on it and it's yellow. Well, they have like all the colors, but I got yellow because wait, it kind of goes with the brown. Like this is so, cute babe so make sure you watch my amazon lives because i will be talking about this and all the stuff i get but i'm just showing you new stuff to, that i'm trying out everything that i open or mention in here i will link it below okay i just got a solid black pair of tights i'm sure these were so cheap so i'm sure they're gonna rip and put holes in them the first time i wear them but the only other pair that i have has holes in them and lately i've just been wanting to style things with tights so i just went on amazon and got me a cheap pair of tights i got medium because even though it says like for my weight and stuff to get a small i never listen because i do not like tight things on my body at all oh baby girl so i got the medium another thing i got so i kind of had this rule that i was going to stop buying hangers and just start getting rid of clothes every time i got new ones you know and that just has been hard for me so i ordered 50 more hangers now own 
about 600. So I honestly think it's way more than 600, maybe more than a thousand hangers in that closet. <sighs> and it's all color coded, but anyway, so I get the black velvet ones. I'll link those below. They're the best ones because your clothes don't slip off of them and they make your closet look so sleek and organized. If it's not color coded, it makes it look better, but I think you should color code it. Let me just go ahead and open it. I just got a picture frame from Amazon because this girl from her small business sent me like a printed frame it's like a poster i guess she's starting to make or she makes i don't know and um i want to hang it but i want it in a frame so i ordered a frame on amazon and i think i'm gonna paint it all right all right i'm so glad like i don't get fomo anymore i mean sometimes i do but not really i don't have a toxic boyfriend so i don't really get fomo holy shit this is fucking huge look at it mate it's a solid frame so i'm gonna put my picture in there motherfucker I just cleaned my room and I'm making such a mess. Okay, and then next I got, so my hoop earrings that I wear every single motherfucking day and like all my chains and stuff that I normally wear are from ALV Jewels. So I love them so much. They're literally my besties. They sent me their like winter collection. So I'm really excited about that. I'm gonna actually open it on TikTok. So go to my TikTok to see that. All right, hope you liked my unboxing. Goodbye. Love you, bitch. like what I want to film on TikTok and what I want to put on YouTube like right now oh my god I have a bug bite guys why do I get bug bites inside my apartment does that mean I have bugs don't answer that actually because I'm I will start crying but like I literally just wake up with them like and I sleep on the couch sometimes uh, they'll be like on the back of my leg I don't want to know Shh, I should have said that because I don't want to know but um I'm gonna get unready nighttime routine I guess it's like midnight. I'm getting like tubby. Like it's actually showing. Frick. The first thing we had to take our jewelry off. I really don't like the feeling of jewelry, but I feel so much prettier with jewelry on. <sighs> oh, there she go. Okay. So, Frick, hold on. Be right back. I know the lighting's terrible, but bear with me. This is my holy grail. It's probably not going to focus because this camera so. This is the Clinique Take the Day Off Cleansing Balm, and it literally melts your makeup off. Like I rave about it all the time. White rags really expose me. But some people don't like using rags. Well, I'm not some people. So let's take a little bit of our cleansing balm, put it on our facey poo, and then you literally just mix water with it. Put the water on your face a little bit. Like I just literally put it with my hands and you can't tell but it's literally melting your face off. Like when I use this in the bath, it's disgusting because it just literally melts into the water. Just wait. Comes right off. I really don't even like need to scrub it. Sorry, that's loud. I really don't even like need to scrub it because it literally melts right off, but we just exfoliating, babe. We're just exfoliating, okay? Okay. Oop. I 
used to try so hard to like preach what people preach if that makes sense hold on by that i mean i've obviously known that makeup wipes aren't good for you so i've like wanted to you know stop using them in my videos and stuff but the truth is i love makeup wipes and i personally do not care that they're not good for me because they're really easy for me to use and they get my makeup off in an efficient way so since they work for me i'm gonna use them like if they're bad for the environment well, that's a different story but my body my choice you know what i'm saying so yeah don't recommend them not trying to be a bad influence but i am telling you i'm being real with you I use them <laughs> literally not even trying to be like funny or anything like oh, i love makeup wipes i stand them yup normally do that before the cleansing balm but i was just trying to show you like how good my makeup just straight up melted off so now i'm putting the cleansing balm on one last time do a little final final clean All right, I'm gonna let my face dry for a sec and put on a t-shirt because why the heck am I in a tight sports bra? I have a million t-shirts and I literally think it's so funny that I accidentally put this exact one on only when I film videos, so. Am I gonna change? No. Holy crap, I look very scary. All right, next I'm gonna, I'm gonna, it's used. My Mario Badescu. Yes, I still use this. Woo! And then moisturize and sunscreen. And I really need to brush my teeth. I need to clean. It's literally disgusting. I'm disgusting. But at least I washed my face. Mother Pearl. I still can't. Okay, there we go. Well, that was fun. Thanks for doing that with me. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go edit some TikTok vlogs now. Actually, no, I'm watching this show called La Bale. L-A-B-E. Okay, I don't know how to say it. But it's on Hulu and it's so good and there's a new episode out. So that's what I'm gonna do. You know what I'm gonna do? I hope to God I'm in focus. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna unbox some packages. I just got back in town and I have a lot of things to open. First, here's all the shit in my mailbox that we do not care about. Sorry. Oh, I can't open this. This is a gift. This is my boyfriend's birthday present that came in the mail when I wasn't here. So now it's gonna be his Christmas present. That's how things work around here. Oh my God. These are those jeans from Shop Alley Grace that like all those big influencers wear. And they're really expensive, but I had to like measure it. She custom makes the pair of jeans for you and your body and you answer all these questions. I ordered it, it took like, I wanna say five weeks. Can you imagine if they don't fit? So cute, we love that. Oh my God, so freaking excited. Oh my God, I have to try them on for y'all. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. They smell like she sprayed stuff. All right, stay tuned, I'll let you know how they fit. Oh, I think I know what these are. I think these are some pants that I ordered from Amazon that took a month to come in. Yup. So I got two different colors. So I got two different colors, but I got different sizes in each of the colors because it took a month, so at least one will work. I'm kind of hoping the red ones work. I have a feeling they won't. Try those on. Okay, I have no idea what this is. Cool. Stella Rose Home. Christy, I'm excited for you to try our charcoal bags. They're eco-friendly, non-toxic. The charcoal absorbs out odors from moisture from the air. Wait, what? Bamboo charcoal bags, air purification. So I guess you just sit them around in your home. What? Wait, there's so many of them. That's so cute. Huh, I gotta do more research on what exactly these are, but I think you just sit them around your home. And I guess they do whatever it said. Cool. Thanks, Stella Rose. Oh, look, that's their little Instagram. I'll put it below. I always look so ugly when I do unboxings. <laughs> Looks like it's a poster or something. This poster company, or not this poster company, this like home decor thing, they let, they're gonna send me something I want. And I've been looking on their website for a month and I literally like just can't make a decision on what I want for my house. I'm breaking now. Guys, my boobs are so sore all the time. Oh wait, I remember, she messaged me. Christy, love your style, I love your TikToks. I hope you're gonna love the poster and hope it finds a cute new space in your apartment besides 18 by 24. <gasps> that is so cute. Look at that, this like literally goes with all my stuff. I'll put her below too. Oh wait, I'm really excited to frame this. Ayo. <laughs> now I gotta buy a frame for it. What do we have here? Oh, okay, so this is a jewelry brand in Nashville and I took a picture in front of there cause they were all decorated and I took a picture in front of their like place on Instagram and then they were like, wait, we'd love to send you stuff. I didn't even go inside cause I'm awkward. But I was like, wait, yeah, please. Oh my God, they sent me so much. It's like Christmas. Cute, love that. Oh, I guess that's it. Oh, this is from Bliss. They send me PR sometimes. Let's see what it is. <laughs> Youth got this. Cute, love it. 
This is adorable. Oh my god, look, there's a little camera. So you can shop this at Target. They always send me like their face products. This is so cute. Oh my god. I love this so much. Okay, my camera's gonna die, but let me show y'all. Let's look at some of this jewelry. I really don't know what to expect. Aw, self-acceptance. <gasps> Shut up. Look how pretty that is. I don't know if it'll focus. This is, this is a ring. It's adorable. <gasps> Bro, these are so cool. It tells you what the little gemstones they are and what they mean. Inspiration, that's when self-acceptance. Oh, this is so cool. They sent me so many. Oh, they wrote me a little note. Christy, we hope you love your new jewels. We picked stones that have special meaning. You can hold close to your heart. We can't wait to see you rocking them. Keep sparkling. Julia Riley. Aww. Look at those earrings. That's beautiful. I feel like I wear the same jewelry, so it's really cool to have some different kind of stuff. These are stunning. <gasps> Look at this bracelet. My camera autofocus sucks. I love that. Oh my god, oh my god. Two more, two more. Bear with me. I wish I knew how to like box things this cute. Okay. The great pleasure in life is doing what others say you can't. True. That's like the best fucking feeling ever. <gasps> Shut the front door. Oh my god. I love this so much. It's a simple little gold heart. You can't even see it, but it's we love that. Oh, oh my god, wait, I love all of this. It's amazing. It's amazing. Oh, and a butterfly. Dude, this is literally all stuff I like. Like they picked out the perfect stuff for me. This is a butterfly. This is like probably all of what I would have picked out. So I'll put them down below too. But thank you so much. Butterfly collection. And there's like literally meanings to all of this. Okay, I just made a mess, but oh, love that. Thank you so much, everyone. That was a fun little unboxing. Sorry I look like poo-poo, but cool.